Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last week, Microsoft rolled out their latest Windows 11 Canary Bolt 25352 to the insiders in the Canary channel, which included the latest hot off the presses features for last week. Now, as I mentioned in that video, which by the way, I'll leave a link to in the description for what it's worth, because as I mentioned in that video, there was only actually one new feature that did roll out to the Canary channel, which was a new widget picker experience, which also rolled out to the dev channel. So it rolled out to Canary and dev channels in the insider program last week. And um, last week, we just touched very briefly on the new widget picker experience in that video. So I thought this may be a good time just to dive a little bit more deeper into more or less what to expect if and when Microsoft does make this new widget picker experience available um, to up and coming stable versions of Windows 11. Now, as many of you would know, um, if we head over to the widget board, currently in the stable version of Windows 11 22H2, to add a new widget to the widget board, we head up to the add widgets button at the top, we click on that, and yeah, we get the so-called widget picker in the stable version, where you can just click on the relevant add signs to add that widget to your widgets board. Now, this could all be set to change as mentioned. And if we just head over to a screenshot provided by the Windows enthusiast Albacore over on Twitter, this will give us a general idea as more or less what to expect if and when this new widget picker experience rolls out to an up and coming stable version in the future. Now, um, as we can see here, basically just to sum this all up, um, it allows you to preview a widget before adding it to the actual widget board, which is a feature which is currently unavailable in the stable version. So in the stable version currently, when you add a widget, you have no option to preview that widget. It just adds it directly into and onto the widget board. And as you can see, this is all set to change. And as I always say, I think this would be a nice move in the right direction just allowing you to have a little bit of a thumbnail preview as to what it will look like um, before you actually add it to the actual board. And um, in the stable version, um, the different categories which are now placed to the left in the left-hand menu had that kind of drop-down layout where they were all listed in a drop-down layout, and that's changed. You get now entertainment, sports, tips, traffic, watch list, weather, which have all now been added to the left-hand menu, which I actually think cleans up things quite a lot. Um, it looks a lot less cluttered, a lot more practical, and a lot more minimal to match the look and feel of Windows 11. So that's more or less um, what to expect. And then obviously, if you do decide to um, add that to your board, you just click on the tab button pin, and that will pin that to your widgets board. So that's um, the new widget picker, um, which Microsoft basically says allows you to preview a widget before adding it to the board currently being tested in the latest canary uh, channel build 25352 so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one